Okay, you know how this story starts. In the beginning, there wasn't shit. Literally, nothing but void and darkness. And that's how the darkness liked it. It wasn't until God decreed, turn on the lights, that things got nasty. It started out small. A, a, a planet here, a, a sun there. You, you know, next thing you know, there were humans and cows and, and, and then stuff running all over the place. Needless to say, the darkness was pissed. From then till now, the darkness tore its way through the world, inhabiting one human host after another, each thinking that they were its master. But you can't own the darkness. The darkness owns you. Fast forward to one Jackie Estacado. You know his type. No family, no hope, no future. He ended up about what you'd expect, busting heads for the Franchetti crime family. Life as a whole was pretty dark for Jackie. Then came his 21st birthday, and, and things got a whole lot darker. And then you, you, you might think that inheriting superpowers would, would be pretty cool for Jackie, you, you know, being in the business of killing people and all. But, and if not for the demon living inside of him, you'd be right. See, the darkness it didn't just make Jackie stronger, it, it, it made him a god. But only when lights were out. Next thing you know, the mob turns on Jackie, marks him for death, just like that. It was the New York City mob versus Jackie and the darkness. But as dark as things were for Jackie, there was a light in his life. And, and, and her name was Jenny. Now, now, now these kids, they, they went way back. I don't think anybody would disagree that they were meant for each other. If anything, that's the real tragedy in all this. See, the mob was still after Jackie. Now, they thought the quickest way to get him would be to take away, you know, his, his only reason for living. Killing Jenny was just about the dumbest thing the mob could have done. See, because without her, Jackie not only had nothing left to live for, he had nothing left to lose. As for the darkness, Jackie's kept it locked away for years, you know, but it doesn't matter how hard he tries. No one can hold back the night. If he can't control this thing inside him, pretty soon there won't be anything left. Jackie will be nothing but an empty shell. And that's just how the darkness likes it. Right around the time he died, my father said to me, he said, Jackie, you can't outrun your fate, but you sure as hell gotta try. I didn't really know what he meant back then. See, there was something inside me, something terrible waiting to get out. And when it did, it made me watch the only thing I ever cared about. Get her brains blown out right in front of me. Then it gave me the power to make things right. The kind of stuff you only see in your worst nightmares. The killing only made it stronger. Harder to control. Eventually, I found a way to bury it. Ever since, it's been trying to get back out. It calls itself the darkness. Jackie, it's good to see you. Come on in. Hiya, Vinny. How's your family? Which one? Hey, Jackie. Check out the rack on the brunette to your right. No, no, you're on the right. That's his left, dipshit. Hey, Jackie, check it out. They put up a picture of your dad. He was a good man, your father. Good man. Well, look, this ain't no time to be depressed. Come on, boss. They got your usual table ready. Quinn's are waiting for you. Terrific. Hey there. Hey, yo, Paul, you got you them tickets to the game. My treat. All right, take care. Joey, what's what? Oh, Mr. Galvani, nice to have you back in town. Wait up, this ravioli is too spicy. I can't taste the flavor. Oh, Billy, how you doing? Not bad. Hey, waiter, I'll take this to go. Chop, chop, I gotta run. Oh, sorry about that, Gaston. Here you go, boss. Bon appetit. Hi, Jackie. 
Remember us from the Candy Club? Well, do you? Sure he does. Trust me, ladies. I wish I did. <laughs> Jackie, you stay with me now. Oh, shit, look at his leg. Benny, what do we do? You guys take point. I'm gonna pull Jackie out back. Jackie, listen to me. I'm gonna pull you out back, but you gotta take this. Get these guys off our ass. Benny! I'm gonna slaughter these pigs! Catch my breath. Oh, you gotta give me a second, Jackie. I ain't been to the gym in weeks. Oh, Jesus Christ! Keep off our backs! My boss, listen to me. I can see the kitchen from here. We can make a break for it, but you gotta take both pieces so I can lift you up. All right. Well, I'm a Let's go. Guess. Hurry up, Vinny! Get in there! That does it. Quick, give me a lighter. Burn in hell, Estacado! Pushing him. Still breathing, huh, motherfucker? Come on, come over here. I've got something for you. Embrace the darkness, Jackie. I'm my friend. Oh, fuck. what the hell is that? You see that? Holy shit! It's the devil. Is what the fuck just happened, Benny? Who hit us? I don't know, boss. I don't know. After the explosion, I saw some guy with a limp. He had some weird-looking fucks with him. I, nobody I recognized, though. Where'd that piece of shit go? Oh, they headed down the alley. The rest of our crew's out front, so you can meet up with him on the street. But I'll be right there. I just... just need to get my wind back. Give him hell, Jackie. 
The rest of the guys are out on the street, boss. Head down the alley and meet up with them. Something happened. I don't know, a big explosion. They probably heard it in Kansas. I see you, you fuck! Staccato. He's over here. You're not so tough now, are you? <laughs> Hello, monkey. It's been too long. Give us a hug. I'll pass, but thanks for the help. <sighs> What's that smell? You tell me. I came from your noggin. Could you forget that already? Come on then, let's move!
Alex! It's not! Do me a favor and see if you can open that box up there. Done and done!